like very first thing on my bucket list is i want to skydive hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is ifyok and i'm the owner of mad collection so from the title of this video you kind of like guess what this video is about and someone is smiling <laughs> someone is smiling beside me and just distracting me isn't it tempting so it's been a long time since i did a get to know me uh, video so i just thought i would do one today and then um it's also been a while i posted on here so i thought this would just be a really nice introduction to get back into the swing of things so hopefully um yeah let's just get right into it and um, enough of the rambling so like i said before my name is ifyok and i'm the owner of mad collection which is an african inspired clothing brand and uh, we do women's clothing a bit of men's clothing a bit, a bit of kids clothing and everything else in between so make sure you check us out on www.mattcollection.com so i've got a list of questions in my thing pad which i just got off the internet and i'm just going to go through and um, some of the questions and then answer it and yeah so first first question so first question is where are you from so i'm nigerian and i am from Ibom state which is a small town in south south of nigeria what are three words you would use to describe yourself mm. three words i would use to describe myself so what three words would you use to describe me describe you beautiful oh did you hear that so beautiful and good at sewing clothes good at sewing clothes see and beautiful hairstyles you make beautiful hairstyles i make did you hear that did you hear? and good at babysitting <laughs> daddy good at babysitting oh Zim -Zim. oh Zim -Zim, do you have something to say no yeah okay okay so you describe yourself in three words Smart. Smart. Good at making hot chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Say good at making hot chocolates. <laughs> I don't know what's the third one. <laughs> good at art. Art. What what art are you good at? What specific? I'm good art? at all of them. Everything. Yeah. Wow. I got even what's into my bag. Wow, <laughs> so she's good at um, watermelon. Oh, check out our watermelon. <laughs> okay, so we just went through all the paper she brought back from school, which clearly you can see was a lot of art that they did in school that day. I mean, they just give them so many, so much paper to bring back. It all sells in one day. So, if I want to describe myself in three words, I would say I am beautiful, of course, like Zoe has said. I'm very smart. That's me. Well, and I'm you. smart as well. Yeah, both of us. And Zim Zim is not smart. No, Zim Zim is very smart. Please, I beg. He's smart <laughs> as baby words. <laughs> He's a smart baby. And third thing I used to describe myself is I love to live life like Jaye Jaye, oh. you know, flex. Oh. You, you know, you only live once. Eh, eh okay so next question how many countries have you been to and which is your favorite country and um, i have been to 23 countries because your girl loves to travel i can't quite name all of them i'll probably just name some paris i've been there a few france i've been there a few times twice or three times i've been to amsterdam i've been to germany I've been to Slovenia and um, Dubai and Mauritius and Ghana and yeah I think the only places I haven't like really touched yet is um, um, Asia I don't think I've been to any country in Asia just yet but it's definitely on my um, travel bucket list Thailand, Fifi Island you know all them nice places you see on the gram <laughs> and my favorite of all the countries mm, that's tough to pick because like i think different countries have like different feel and different vibe too. but the one i think or the it's kind of hard to say one but i think i liked my slovenia experience it was quite a beautiful place and 
I did scuba dive in there, which was really nice. I also like going to Mauritius because, but it was quite a nice place. Um, I did um, parat sailing there and underwater experience. Yeah, because I'm quite adventurous like that. <laughs> Um, so I think those are like my two like obvious obvious highlights. There have been so many others, but instead of giving you one, I decided to add a bonus to the one. So yeah, what's my number one goal in life? My number one goal in life is to be wealthy. I'm when I say wealthy, I mean wealthy all rounder, physically, spiritually, mentally, emotionally, financially. That's like one of them. So financially and spiritually, very top of the list. Emotionally, physically, you know, all of that, all wrapped in one. So that's a nice goal to have, all wrapped in one. The next question says, am I university or have I been to university? So the answer is yes, I have been to university. Um, I did my undergraduate when, when I was in Nigeria and it was in Ignidio University, um, Okada in Edo State. Um, I did IT management, I did computer science and IT and then I moved to the UK in 2010 to do my masters, 2010, that's such a long time ago, that's like 13 years ago, over a decade. <laughs> I moved here to do my masters in IT management. Next question says, do I have any siblings? So yes, I do have siblings. I've got a brother, a younger brother, a younger sister, and an elder sister. So we're four kids in total. This question says, do I have a bucket list? And what is on my bucket list? <laughs> I've got like a long ass bucket list. Um, so like very first thing on my bucket list is I want to skydive. <laughs> Can you imagine? Yes, but I really want to skydive. I almost did it in 2016, but in Dubai, I actually paid for I paid a deposit for it, and I got there, and I think they use your BMI or something or your height or something weird to check, and I was just slightly over by one, just one, and they didn't let me skydive. I was so upset. But it's definitely on my bucket list. I'll probably try doing it in the UK and see if I can do it. Second thing is I want to stay on all them um, above water. Excuse me, Baba. I want to stay on all the above water um, hotel. Um, and I would want to also have like a ship cruise around the Caribbean or around the world, whichever one definitely on my bucket list and I just want to live life and enjoy every moment of life because no one gets out of, of life alive so I might as well leave it to them. Next question is do I want my own family someday? Um, this is kind of obvious. Yes because I already have a handsome baby boy here and so I've got three kids, one girl, two boys so yes what am I what are you most grateful for in life I am grateful for good health I'm grateful for peace of mind I'm grateful for my family I'm grateful for everything for the blessings and the mercies and the grace of God upon my life definitely something to be grateful for what's your favorite TV show mm, I'm not really a TV person <laughs> I listen to TV I don't watch it I listen to it to pass time so that's why I can watch one thing like so many times because the first three times I was probably listening to it and not actually watching it. Um, but when I actually do sit down to look at the TV, um, the one I have really liked was Power. Yeah, Power. Um, let me see. Oh, Person of Interest. I think I quite liked that one. quite liked person of interest and how to get away with murder viola davis i quite liked that one i think i watched that show because of viola now what's my favorite sports hmm. favorite sport i did like to play volleyball when i was younger because it was a fun game to play um and just a lot of track and field um sports I used to, in secondary school, I was quite a good runner. Well, even till now, I'm quite a good runner. <laughs> yeah, 
if I just say so myself, it's just it's just been a long time I've exercised my running muscles. So, what is your dream career, and where do I where do you aspire to be? My dream career. I think I'm living my dream career. So when I finished um, school in 2010, um, because because it was like an IT course, an IT degree, I just wanted to do like it related courses which i did do for quite a long time until i jump shift and started doing um running my clothing brand making clothes and making people look beautiful and um, so i think i'm currently living my dream career which is having a clothing brand or running a clothing brand um, and everything else that comes with um, the clothing brand so yes and that's all the questions i've got today Hopefully you've gotten to know me a bit better. Let me know in the um, comment section down below which of the questions or which of the answers you can relate to. And also you can drop a few um, sentences or comments about you so I can also get to know you. If you've got an Instagram page or YouTube channel, you can also leave that in the um, comment section down below and let's stay connected. All right, guys, thanks for watching um, this video today. I will catch you in the next one. Remember to like, subscribe, share, comment, and all the good things you get to do on this platform. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.